Hi guys, welcome to Fabric Mouse TV. I'm um, just wanting to uh, uh, talk about sewing machine servicing, sewing machine repairs. Um, since uh, lockdown's been eased, uh, it has got pretty crazy to be honest with servicing and repairs. So I uh, just wanted to do a little video, just help us out, help you out, uh, try and speed up the process of everything and what we want and what we need from you. Uh, so if you're bringing in your machine, uh, one of the main things we want you to do is if you can plug in your power cable for us. Um, just plug it into the socket there, take the wire up, put it onto your handle and ideally tie it on here so your foot control can't come off. Uh, so if you can go onto the website, fabricmouse.co.uk, uh, sew machine section, do the drop down, uh, and we have uh, service and repair on there. Uh, if you can book book it in, put on the back of your machine something, a little sticker with the order number. Also put it on your foot control uh, as well. So we've got that tied up. But then the things that we need is we need, a, if there's something wrong with the machine, if it's not stitching properly, please put a sample in uh, so we can see what it's doing. Leave the bobbin in with the thread you're using. Uh, and also leave the thread on that you were using uh, threaded up if possible so that we can start from scratch and try and identify exactly what it is that's going wrong if, it, if there's a problem with the machine or if it's just a, a problem with the threading or something somewhere uh, that's going wrong. Um, things like this. If we can remove any sleeve arms, toolboxes, extra bits, uh, anything, storage, if you've got a hard case, if you've got instruction books, things like that, we don't need it at the minute. Uh, just try and cut down on any chance of germs. We're going to get your machine, we're going to disinfect it when it arrives, uh, but the least things on it as possible, the, the easiest that's going to be. And also, if we're getting it back to you as well, you'll be able to use it quicker, you'll be able to just douse it down. Um, so... That's about it, main thing. Leave your bobbin in, uh, leave your thread on the bobbin, put your thread on, leave your thread threaded up. If you've got a sample, leave it in. If it's doing something wrong, if it's not stitching right in the bottom, not stitching right in the top, not stitching at all, leave a sample in. Um, if you can't do any kind of sample, if it's not doing anything, uh, if you can just write a note, put it underneath uh, your foot, explaining it's not working this is what happened when you when it stopped working if you can if there was a loud noise or there was a bang a uh, crunch that sort of thing or it just started whirring uh, and if you can explain it came from the top came from the bottom then we can sort of identify it a lot easier uh, it'll be easier uh, if there's anything uh, on the machine that you want and checked uh, you Needle thread is not working, uh, bobbin's not winding, things like that. These things, we don't always check. Uh, we used to just thread in the machine up by hand, so we don't always check if your needle thread is working. So please tell us if it isn't, and then we can replace it as part of the service. Again, if you've left a bobbin in for us, we're, we're not going to wind a bobbin. Uh, so tell us if your bobbin winder's not working properly, uh, and then we'll, we'll change that and swap it out as part of the service. Uh, thanks a lot. Thanks for tuning in to Fabric Mouse. Uh, bring your machine in. The other thing to note is, uh, at least until sort of September 2020, all machines will be left outside. We've got an area for leaving things outside. It's knock on the door. Uh, makers are aware, uh, but you can't bring them into the shop. We'll come out and get them afterwards and, and sort of take care of them. Uh, thanks a lot, and we'll see you when things get back to normal. Music